We are at the Milwaukee Art Museum today in Milwaukee, Wisconsin. It is located on Lake Michigan and is one of the largest art museums in America. Perhaps the best part of this beautiful museum is the Santiago Calatrava designed building. Calatrava is a Spanish architect and this may well be his finest work. Of the 25,000 pieces of art at this museum, here are the top 25. Number one, Calatrava's Bris Soleil, or the Sunbreaker Movable Wings. This is an architectural feature that reduces heat gain within the building by deflecting sunlight. Number two, the beautiful and striking interiors in the Calatrava building. Number three, no trip to Milwaukee is complete without a Pabst Blue Ribbon. Number four, every great museum in America has a Klaus Oldenburg sculpture. And great, great Roy Lichtenstein pop art. Number six, Kehendi Wiley. He's the guy that did the portraits of the Obamas. Here is a rare find from multi-talented artist Julian Schnabel, a plate painting. Sigmar Polk is a German painter and photographer. Francisco Zerberon is a Spanish painter who died in 1664. This is likely the happiest painting in the collection, a dog by Alex Katz. Number 12, the man who discovered America, Norman Rockwell. Number 14, a beautiful Picasso piece from his later years. Number 15, the color field specialist, Ellsworth Kelly. There are many works in the museum from Wisconsin native Georgia O'Keeffe. Just in case you were wondering, the artwork is the man standing against the wall. Number 19, a kinetic sculpture by Alexander Calder, located at the building's entrance. Italian painter Nardo di Sioni died in 1366. Charles Thomas or Chuck Close is an American painter who does photorealism. And number 25, last but not least, portraits by Robert Henri. This was my first visit to the Milwaukee Art Museum, and I left, in a word, impressed. I hope you enjoyed the tour of the Milwaukee Art Museum and the beautiful Calatrava building.